So Freddie Anderson stole the show of the Hurricanes vs. Islanders game one of their playoff series. He was spectacular throughout this game. He made big stop after big stop. And it's not like these were gimmies. Now the scoring would start off, cuts Nets off very early on. Bumper slot. Just Nets off with a shot. He scores! He shoots that off the left face-off dot in the offensive zone and just nips Varlam off top shelf. Hurricanes go up 1-0. Now I will say, the Islanders played really good in this game as well. A lot of blocked shots, Varlamov made some really good stops as well. And later in the first period, the Islanders would get on the board. Same thing, it's the playoffs. Anderson scrambles, he won't get it! Shot on goal, Anderson thought he had it, McLean would bury home the loose puck. We got ourselves a tied game. I have to commend how great the Islanders played in this game. Some people might be upset with my prediction of them getting swept, but if they keep playing like this, they can prove me wrong. I really liked the intensity they brought forth. They were blocking shots like crazy. They did not let a lot of pucks through, which made Varlamov's day a bit easier. And then about four minutes, 34 seconds left in the second period, Ajo would have a really bad turnover, but Anderson was there to bail him out. And both goalies would make some good saves in the second and then go into the third. Anderson gets tripped by his own defender, and just look at him throw up the glove and blocker. What an incredible save. That should have been in the back of the net. Keeps this a 1-1 game. And then Nason would get on the board with a big one. Who's nets off off bodies? They score! Hurricanes go up 2-1. Seeing some good physicality like this hit by Jarvis on Dobson. Riley would be high stick by Nason. And Paul Mary would have a great chance to tie this game, just misses it. That's a tough look, really needs to get that one, just unfortunate. And then a minute later, he ends up slashing Slavin. The Hurricanes would go on the power play, but nothing would come of it. Ultimately, the Islanders would pull their goaltender. Natchez would get an empty net goal. Hurricanes win this game 3-1. to one. Freddie Anderson is a great goaltender that I feel does not get enough credit. He shows up in these big moments. Has he had some stinkers from time to time? Absolutely every goal he does. But he was just locked in making big save after big save. Without this elite level performance, the Islanders could have won game one. And with how much he's had to persevere through this year, I'm assuming this guy's got to be winning the Masterson. Like, it's just incredible to see what he's done coming back from blood clots. And as for Islander fans, you got to be relatively happy with that performance. Yeah, you don't get the win. You don't get the outcome you wanted. But for the most part, you locked up a really good Carolina Hurricanes team. If they play like this every single game, they're going to be low scoring affairs. But that's how the Islanders are going to have to play if they want to win. I'd like to know your thoughts down below in the comment section. Who impressed you the most in this game? I'm Captain Paul. I'll see you in the next one.